Monday the 1st of April, April Fool's Day. Hello. Hello, do uh, it. Do it. Our weekend in Waterford is over. Where are we going today? At Dublin via Kilkenny. That's it. Nice, simple, easy. Should we do it? Let's do it. To the trains. All of them. Friday night, it was dark. We didn't get to see any of the river, now we can see it. Um, two things to note, incredibly sad, uh, Joseph Plunkett, whom this station is named after, I was reading uh, Vicky's Irish history book over the weekend, uh, before he was executed as part of the, uh, the 1916 uprising. He was married for just 15 minutes. They allowed him to be married uh, before his execution. Read up on the history. It's very sad and sombre for a Monday morning. Um, slightly more excitingly, getting back to the trains, we noticed on this train this morning, there's not a first class, there's a premier class. It's a bit like when we did um, the Gerald train in Wales, and they don't have first class, they have business class. Anyway, we're on our way, and Vicky is going to explain our route today. Nice new t-shirt. Thanks. This Where are we going? Uh, we're travelling currently on the line from Waterford up to Dublin and we're going to get out at Kilkenny. We have a very tricky pronunciation at the station after Kilkenny. Yeah, it's not the actual name, is it, or something? Yeah, yeah so we should... Uh, Speak to a local. ...do that definitely on the way. And then where do we end the day? We end the day back at Dublin. I've also got a new T-shirt on. You may recall when you signed up to watch all the stations that in the small print we did endeavour to get a picture slash video clip of every station, which is why this is Thomastown. Oh, hello. I was expecting I forgot we're right at the front. Thomastown. I'm back on the train. <laughs> That's our driver. <laughs> We've got to kill Kenny. We've given Paul one of our flyers. Paul's now going to look at our website. <laughs> Why do you love the railways, Paul? You do love the railways, right? Uh, good money. Good money. <laughs> <laughs> what? I can already see the castle. Is there time to go to the castle? Yes. I will make time. There are literally a hundred things I want to do in Kilkenny, but we can't do them all. I've downloaded a map of the medieval mile, and I'm going to see how much I can traverse and what sites I can discover. St John's Priory. This is St John's Bridge. There's supposed to be a castle around here somewhere. The Medieval Mile Museum is the official start of the Medieval Mile Tour. It's inside this beautiful converted 13th century church um, and it tells you the story of Kilkenny from its medieval origins. The town hall behind me um, was built in 1761 and this columned arcade area was originally a marketplace. Kilkenny is also the location of the first recorded person to have been convicted and killed for the crime of witchcraft. Alice Kettler, who lived in this house behind me, was accused of witchcraft along with several other of her associates. But it wasn't Alice who eventually burnt at the stake, it was her servant, Petronella de Myth, who was tortured and confessed to witchcraft and she died on the 3rd of November 1324. just full of these tiny treasure troves, little alleyways, nooks and crannies. The hole in the wall looks like an amazing cafe, coffee place. I've just got no time, there's no time. Kilkenny Castle is just 
incredible. Surprisingly, it is unlike the other castles we've seen so far on our journey. This is actually a Norman-style castle. The Normans came to Ireland in the 12th century and Kilkenny was one of the castles they originally built. First of all, uh, it was a wooden fortress and later rebuilt in stone. This, here at Kilkenny Station, is the old station building. The line used to carry on back in the day uh, along to Port Leash, no more, but the remains of the old station still here. That's it, quick train fact. Maybe we should call it quick train fact or something. We've got to, got to get my train. Come on. which is known as, I can't say it Jeff, I've only learnt to say Munov Jorg. What is it actually called? You're having a sandwich. You're having a sandwich. No, it's Beganliston, I think. Oh my god, we're in too much trouble. The point M is... Munov Jorg is what it's officially called official on the map. Names, but apparently nobody calls it that. In my defence, it is lunchtime. So uh, having... How is that a defence? Oh, train. Stop filming! <laughs> It's not a good look to film someone eating or drinking. I always say this. You know why? Because it's true. <laughs> Carlo. Tick. We've met Ed. Hey guys. You brought us a bag of goodies. Yeah. Are you, are you from Carlo? I live in Carlo. Give us an amazing fact about. Oh, give us an. Oh, 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 oh. Bye. Bye. No, 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 no. Oh no! Ed, if you're watching this, I really thought we had more time and I was going to get Ed to give us a fact about Carlo <laughs> and then the door's closed. Oh Ed, you legend! Oh bless him! Killed Ed. Thank you for travelling with your and there. Thank you for having us. Uh, we're going to change at Newbridge. Uh, after this, our train goes fast, fast, fast to Dublin. I don't know why I say it like that sometimes. Um, so this is one of those cases where uh, a train, a uh, long distance train then goes fast and doesn't stop at the sort of the, the stopping surface. So we're changing to the stopping surface so we can knock out things like Salent and Nass and Hazel Hatch and somewhere. We've got to change to the stopper, to the suburban Dublin stopper as we uh, head back into Dublin. And I've got no idea if, it is, if it's on like an adjacent platform or over a footbridge. So uh, we're about to find out. So there we go, a lovely lady on the platform down there has told us that our train is the stopping service that's come up from Porsche Lease. The one that's on the, over on that other bay platform, on platform three, is the rare service that goes through the tunnel and doesn't go into Houston. It goes round through the tunnel and into Connolly and down to uh, Grand Canal Dock. We should catch that, we should get the, the tunnel train. Which is the new bridge at Newbridge. Newbridge. Are you making a tacky Newbridge joke? Can I just get in a nerdy filmmaker's thing? The frequency at which the dot matrix displays work on the platform and the trains are different to the British ones and it messes up with the default frame rate on my Canon camera. I don't have this problem in Britain. If I wanted to make it look good, I'd have to shoot manual. Sorry. On the plus side, have you noticed how we've had zero hassle, zero hassle off staff for taking photos and filming? In Britain, all the time you get like, what are you doing? Right here, they're like, sure, in, in fact, go ahead, in fact, <laughs> help yourself, take a picture. I had a, a guy approach me on the train at Rath, Rathmore station and I thought, oh, he's going to come and tell me, he goes, you f you're filming trains? And I was like, oh, yeah, we're doing a project and I was about to get a fly and he went, 
if you get to the front of the train, you'll see another one pass by. It's a great shot. And I was like, oh, yeah. okay. So, so here, the staff don't tell you off. They literally encourage you and give you tips. <laughs> Irish Rail, thanks. <laughs> Hazel Hatch and Selbridge, uh, which looks fairly new, new platforms, new ticket office. And we'd heard a rumour that there was a TFL style roundel here. Uh, so we put a question out on Twitter and everyone said, yes, it's here in the new ticket office. So you ready, Jeff? I'm ready. The National Railway Heritage Award, the London Underground Accessibility Award, presented to Erin Red Aaron for Hazel Hatch and Selbridge Station restoration by Lord Adonis. Well, that's really interesting. Why would London Underground award a station in a completely different country? How quaint is Adamstown, Vicky? <laughs> So if you've got a scale of, of cute, yeah. cute, cute, quaint, yeah. quaint, 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 yeah. I put it on this scale. Yeah, on the functional on scale. On the functional scale. scale. Maximum function. We're arriving back into Dublin, Houston, but that is not the end of our day. We're going to meet someone. Someone rather special. So our mystery guest has brought us down the side of Houston Station where we're going to have a chat. Uh, my mystery guest's name is Michael... What's her name? Common. Common. Good evening. Good evening. Nice to meet you. You might not recognise him, but you might... By face, but you might if I got you to say something. Could you say something that people might recognise you by? The next station's at is Dublin Central. No, that's you, a, not Dublin Central. That's <laughs> not a station in the, you've in the old days. In the old days, you might have... Yeah. You, you are the voice that does the announcements, the English ones. The English ones, yes. On the Irish Rail train. Exactly. How do you get that job? It was just being in the right place at the right time. Okay. I was in a radio studio and the Irish Rail rang and said, would uh, somebody like to record the announcements for us? That was back in 1996. Right. And I've been doing it ever since. So when we get off the train today and it's like the next- Plus me now. No, in the background. So yeah. can you hear in the background now? You're, so you do station, station call announcements as well? And on the trains themselves as well. Yeah. Wow. That's a long time since I've done so, that one, so that's why it was a bit of a memory one. I made a joke like, you suppose you're in the studio for three days. You were like, it was, no, yeah. three days. Yeah, yeah. So you read yeah. through every station name, every... 1,600 words and sentences. Like what? One, two, three, one. Two, three. So you have to do them with different intonations. Different intonations. And they then edit them. The computer stitches them all together. So that it yeah. then goes the next step on yeah. platform Unfor two five, or platform three. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, okay. Yeah. Do you have a favourite station name on the Irish Rail Network? Oh, that's an interesting yeah. one. Yeah. The next station is Lansdowne Road. Please stand clear of the closing doors. Now that's on the dart. That's isn't on it? the dart. Yeah. Do you get closing doors on, on the Irish Rail train? No, or is it just I, the dart? It's the dart, I think, is that one. Yeah. And then the other one, of course, is there's a welcome on board announcement when you come on the train. So on behalf of you and we're there and welcome on board the service to Cork. No, it's terrible. That's the voice. That's the, one, that's the yeah. voice we've been hearing. Oh my god. Now on the dart, is there a mind the gap as well? Because oh, there is. That's that's the most heard one. And that's but that's dart specific, isn't it? it which is, is which excites me because it's a bit like the tube on the underground. Mind the gap. Mind the gap. That's all I usually have to say. And people go, oh, I've heard this guy somewhere before. Mind <laughs> the gap. There is one as well on things like the Cork station because there's a bit of a gap there. Yes. You'll hear it specifically. But for the most part, that's it. Hundreds and hundreds of times a day. And no, I'm not on a per performance fee. <laughs> that would be really good. If that were. Back home in London and England, yes. there's this security phrase that I, I understand is, 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 is there's a genuine need, but it also drives us nuts, right? And yeah. people will never forgive me if I don't get you to say, okay. see it, say it, sort it. What it actually is, is if you see something suspicious, please call the British Transport Police and oh, see it, right, say it, sort it. That's too long, okay. <laughs> well, let's do the short version. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, here it is. See it, say it, sort it. <laughs> it's the voice! You're the voice! That's I love it. that you're the voice! Michael, that's it! Thank you. pleasure! Thank you so now, much! Listen, be careful, mind the gap! Mind the hey. <laughs> You can wave goodbye, thanks so much! That's the end of our Bye. day Yay. here at Dublin, Houston! <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow, we're going uh, to Limerick yes. uh, via the Nina line, the very strange two trains a day. The next station is the Bird Hill. <laughs> Try that one! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching all the stations.
The town of Kilkenny was built, um, it's clearly built at some point.